Okay, so obviously you're going to want to start off with a clean sink, which you can see the sink looks pretty clean. So once your sink is clean, you're going to want to fill up your sink with some lukewarm water. I'm not going to fill the sink completely um, up to the top, but I am going to let it get about halfway full and then I'm going to add some essential oil to my sink. And that looks like it's about halfway filled. So now I'm going to put some Thieves essential oil from um, Young Living. So this is the regular Thieves blend right here. And then I also have the one with the white label and all of Young Living's um, white label essential oils are from the Vitality line, which means they have been approved by the FDA for ingestion. And so let's say one, two, three, four, five, hmm, why not six? Six drops, I'm gonna put my hand in here, which my hands have already been washed, and just kind of mix that together. And, oh gosh, guys, that smells so good. And now I'm going to just add my fruit. quarantine scale has not been kind to me stepped on it this morning and I was like you know what we need some fresh fruit and vegetables in our life so you can see here that all the um, fruit and vegetables are in the water now and it looks like some like these carrots are sticking up a little bit so I'm just gonna add a bit more water And a little extra thieves never hurt anyone. So I'll put a little more thieves in the water and just a little bit more vinegar. Okay, so nothing harsh in here. The vinegar and the thieves is better than just using plain water and I'm actually going to do just a little bit of Dr. Bronner's soap. This is Dr. Bronner's Castile soap. This is the pure baby unscented one and if you look at the label and on the label there's like writing all of this is writing so there's writing everywhere but if you look at number seven it says a dash and bowl of water to remove residue from fruits and veggies, rinse clean. So a dash is not really a specific <laughs> measurement. I think I'll call a dash one teaspoon. So we will just put a teaspoon of Dr. Bronner's Pure Castile Soap in here. And don't be scared by the name soap. This Castile Soap is completely plant-based and organic. So the ingredients are water, coconut oil, potassium hydroxide, palm kernel oil, olive oil, hemp oil, jojoba oil, citric acid, and tosopherol. Okay, so completely safe. So we're just gonna put a dash of that in here and give it a nice mix. And this is how, um, since quarantine, I've been washing my fruits and veggies. So I just scrub my vegetable brush and give each fruit or vegetable a good scrub. Before this whole global situation happened, I would always wash my fruits and vegetables, but I wouldn't give it a whole lot of thought. You know, I just run the apple under the water for a few seconds, wipe it off and call it a day. But in light of the 2020 current events, I really have been giving a little more time and attention to cleaning my fruits and vegetables. I like to just do it as soon as I purchase them so that, you know, I don't have to go through this thing each time um, that I need a lemon or whenever I want to give my son an orange. So this is it guys, quick and very simple. All you need is a few things, vinegar, uh, Thieves Essential Oil Blend and Dr. Bronner's Castile Soap. This I always get from Aldi. I will um, link below the Thieves Essential Oil, the Vitality Thieves, um, the one with the white label. Once they've all been washed and they're all in the other sink, I am going to rinse them all and then put them on this towel that I've laid out over here to dry. So I hope that you guys found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up 
and uh, like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. See you in the next one, guys. Bye.